Richard Knowles yesterday about the challenge of pressuring a guy like that guy who can spend plays so well. He mentioned that it has to be a coordinated pass rush. What is, what is a coordinated pass rush? Uh, we can't get uh, undisciplined with our rush lanes. We know he likes to uh, scramble and make plays with his legs, so we can try to limit that as much as possible. How much does the the film of last year, the experience of last year, help when you are playing with that time? Uh, it helps a lot, uh, knowing what he's going to do. Already have played him, he did what he did last game. We really played him. Uh, it's basically the same thing. He's just more agile now. He don't got his knee brace. And, yeah. yeah. What makes him difficult to defend, uh, defend? Like out of structure, especially on play action. Like when he gets out there, he can make plays. How do you stay disciplined as a defensive line? You just got to contain him. There's no like, no, uh, no free rushes. You got to stick to the game plan. Uh, and yeah. Stay in your rush lane. Don't let them out the pocket, basically. Jim Knowles talked about you yesterday and how you're playing all of these snaps, but you're still not up to the number of reps that everybody else is in terms of all the practice that you missed. How has that affected you? Has it affected you? Uh, I don't think it's affected me, to be honest. Uh, I'm here to play. I'm ready to play. I feel good. I'm, I'm good. Has it helped not actually having that, that many snaps or just no impact at all, do you think? Uh... I guess you could say that for not as much on my body yet, but I don't think it really affects me. Talking about a quarter like Toyota, you know, it's easy to say, keep him, keep him in the pocket, things like that. How difficult is it in practice when you get him? Say again? How difficult is it in practice? It's easier to say this is what we have to do, right? But then you get out there, he can make plays, you've seen it before. How, how difficult is it to keep a guy like that where you want him to be? Uh, you know, he's a great athlete, so he's going he's gonna to make plays regardless. We just got to try to limit them as much as we can. How do you feel like you've played the first four games of this season compared to your previous years in the last game? Uh, I think I have did more because I've had more reps, but I honestly don't think I'm nowhere near where I should be because, you know, my knee and all that. What, do you, what did you do to earn more reps, do you think? Why are they playing you? Uh, I think I'm just showing it in practice. Um, yeah, showing in practice, uh, getting the trust of the coaches. How close did you feel to having this interception? <laughs> uh, I thought I was going to catch it, but it was just bad hands. I had a lot of tape on my gloves, but still a PBU. Was that fun to drop in the coverage like that on the you and Mike there? Yeah, it's definitely fun. It's different. You know, you're not hitting somebody every play, but it was kind of fun. How much have you done that? How much have you done that over your career? Uh, we work on it here and there. What, what did you think of that call in that moment? Uh, I think it was a great call. It obviously uh, caught them off guard, so forced them into a bad pass. I just got to catch it. Do you work on the, the Monarch machine at all for that? No, nah, I need to. I need to get on there with Marv or some one of the receivers. I mean, it hit my hands, but I got to catch it. So, do you feel like that breakout game for Mike Hall is coming soon? Um, and, and just what's it like working with him right now on the defense mark? What do you see? Uh, Mike is still the same Mike. You know, teams knew, know what he can do now, so they're sliding to him, uh, you know, double teaming every, every play. So, production is going to go down when they're keying you already. Yeah. Yeah, on that last play, you know, when they still have one second left, you were in the mix there uh, when they were trying to do that lateral situation. Um, well, so maybe that play and what we were seeing there, you all right on that play too, but it seemed like you made that play. Yeah, I was good. Uh, we knew it was going to be like a lateral situation. It was like 60 yards away from the end zone, so we just had to get him on the ground. And I basically just rolled over. I was just tired, so I just laid down. I'm glad we won. All right, Thank you. Yep. Thank you.